Why not? Why are there so many holes in the wall around the dartboard? Those are uh, from other players. Yeah, we never miss a shot. Get out of here. No, really. Pick your number. You need it. All right. Let's see. Land one right in the eye of that skull over the door. No problem. Hey, you're pretty good. All right. I bet you can't hit another one on the first shot. Name it and I'll eat it. I bet you can't hit a bullseye. Ha! That's easy. Okay. That's impressive. I bet you can't hit another one on the first shot. Name it and I'll eat it. Let's see. I bet you can't hit that guy over there. Oh, trying to be tricky, huh? Oh, they were talking about the, uh, <laughs> wow, they were talking about me. Okay. <laughs> I bet you can't hit another one on the first shot. Name it and I'll eat it. Okay, uh, let's see. There's no way you'll be able to hit the center of that life preserver on the kitchen door. Oh, trying to be tricky, huh? Nice. Hey, you're pretty good. Who's winning? Right now, we're in a dead tie. All right, let's see what else option, what other shot, options do we have. Uh, big stuffed fish, post on the right side of the screen. You know what? Never mind, I believe, I believe you. you. You better. All right. Uh... Would you strapping young specimens like to join my pirate crew? I would, but once I win the melee championship, I'm gonna have to go on tour to win the Tri-Island Dart Throwers Championship. Actually, you will be able to join this crew since I will be winning the Melee Island Championship. Says you, Swabby. Knows me, Cracker Brain. <laughs> well, I guess I'll be shoving off now. Are you still here? Yeah, just leave him for now. All right, what about you? Hey, Alan, hello, oh, master of all things grog-like. What can I do for you, Mr. Marley? Uh, three foot. All right, uh... Sorry about that, Mr. Threepwood. What, he thought I took my wife's name? I think the way this is done. All right. This place is quieter than a crypt full of mines. Isn't it a crying shame? It's been that way since that Australian blew into town. Australian? Aye. A scurrilous Australian land developer who's been using strong-arm tactics to buy up all the land on Mealy Island. Half of our regular clientele have been driven off island by the no-good scoundrel. Wow. Do you know anything more about this Australian developer? Not really. I'd surely love to give him a piece of my mind, though. How'd you like to join a crew of courageous pirates on a dangerous quest? Ooh, that sounds like fun. Great. But I should really check with my boss first. Hey, boss! What? Can I have a few days off to join Mr. Threepwood here on a swashbuckling adventure? Are you out of your grog-addled mind? No. I guess I can't go. Damn. <laughs> You got any snacks? I've got some pretzels. Well, that seems harmless enough. Yep. The scum bar's famous kudu jerky pretzels. Ooh. Got anything else? Mm, not really. Okay, let's have some. Yeah. Sorry, can't give you any. What? What? Why? Why did you... That drunk at the table over there? He has the last basket. Can't uh. you give them to me without a basket? Sorry. It's scum bar policy. All right. Grog me, barkeep. Why, I'd be glad to. After you show me some ID. <laughs> ID? I don't get to show you no stinking ID. You do if you want any grog. Aww. I've got troubles. Like what? The government is trying to blow up my house. Well, that's a crying shame, Mr. Threepwood. Yeah, if anyone's gonna blow up my house, it should be me. I haven't got a crew to take me to Lucre Island. Hmm. You know, there's probably a pirate or two hanging around that could be coaxed into joining your crew. What about a ship? a ship to take me to Lucre Island. You might want to try the Melee Island Municipal Shipyards. Does Stan still work there? No, no, no. The whole place is run by the Harbor Mistress these days. Harbor Mistress? Aye. She's very by the book. Although, <laughs> she does have her tender side. If her tender side is anything like the painting behind you, I don't want to see it. <laughs> 
Uh, on second thought, I hate listening to myself whine. You and me both, brother. <laughs> no, really, grog me. No, really. ID. What, don't I look like I'm 14? Actually, you look like you're about 15. But we're carding anyone who looks under 23 just to be safe. <laughs> uh, I've got to go. Right, well, grog, do that. All right. Let's go up here. Can I? Not even a life preserver will save Wasn't there a dart there? Aw. Mmm, kudu jerky pretzels. Yeah. All right. Um, I think I know what I need to do because I need those pretzels. I I remember that I need the pretzels. I don't remember why I need them, but I know I need the pretzels. Oh, again, mateys. And now I'm getting hungry. <laughs> All right, uh, let's try another one. Another one on the first shot. Name it and all. Can you hit that big stuffed fish over there? No problem. Will he actually hit the stuffed fish, or will he do what I want? Damn, he hit the stuffed fish. Nice shot. All right. <sighs> I bet you can't hit another one on the first shot. Name it and all. How about that post on the right side of the screen? What's the master at work? All right, a little bit of fourth wall breaking though, because it said screen. You can't hit another one on the first shot. Name it and all. There we go. You can't hit that balloon over there. No problem. I um, I shouldn't be laughing because I I, I think we may have just killed that guy. <laughs> All right, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and take his dirty pencils. No. All right. Hey, how's the weather down there? Oh no, he's just asleep. Okay, so that's good. This fish has seen better days. Can I pick it up? I'm not picking that up. Aww. I can't use them. All right. Hey, stay out of the kitchen, you sissy boy, sea urchin. What? Why? People ever want me to go into the kitchen? Yeah, seriously. Perfect for popcorn. All right, sir. Hey there, scruffy-looking pirate person. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, mighty pirate. What's your name? Cheese, Ignatius Cheese. All right. At least it's not Charles Cheese. How would you like to join my crew of mighty pirates, Mr. Cheese? And what, pray tell, might I be finding myself doing if I joined this crew of mighty pirates? You'd be helping a band of bloodthirsty brigands sack a small fishing village. Ah, that doesn't sound too manly. Any girly pirate can loot a defenseless fishing community. All right. Are you sure you don't want to join my crew of mighty pirates? Well, I don't know. What kind of pirating would I be doing? Oh, let's see. You'd be traveling to Lucre Island with a crew of Cretinous Buccaneers to meet with my wife's lawyers. Now that sounds like a worthy mission for a mighty pirate navigator like myself. Really? I. The seas around Lucre Island are very treacherous and can only be navigated by a skilled sailor. I'd love to face that challenge, but... But what? I can't. Why? Why not? Is your keister glued to that chair? Well, yes, now that you mention it, it is. But that's not why I can't go, Mr. Wizened Pirate. Well, then why? Because if I leave my bar for too long, it'll be stolen out from under me. You're the owner of the scum bar? I, the one and only. Huh. I find it difficult to believe that the scum bar is owned by somebody named I Cheese. Don't make me come over there, Driftwood. Reapwood. Whatever. Anyway, I've been fighting off a hostile takeover bid from an Australian land developer. Come again? You heard me. A greedy Australian is making a grab for my bar. With guns and swords and cannons? Worse, with insults, jibes, and mockeries. It's taken all of my insult arm wrestling skill to keep him at bay. Gosh, if it weren't for the whole wife being declared dead thing, I'd say that was the strangest thing I'd heard all week. <laughs> is there something I could do to convince you to navigate my ship to Lucre Island? I'm open to persuasion. What do you have in mind? I was kind of hoping that you'd cave in due to my incessant nagging. Kid, I've been married for 30 years. So, <laughs> so there's one thing I'm immune to. It's incessant, high-pitched Oh, nagging. man. 
insult arm wrestling? Aye. While you were away, the insult sword fighting paradigm became attached to a host of other pirate pastimes. Paradigm? Well, nowadays you can't throw a dart or, or play a game of checkers without being expected to toss in a <laughs> withering bon mot. I think I tossed a bon mot in a food bite. <laughs> my particular speciality is insult arm wrestling, which I use to defend my bar from hostile takeovers. Wait a minute. Your name is I Cheese? I Cheese? I. Hmm. I'm sorry, but I just can't get over the absurdity of your name. Well, if you say so, Mr. Threepwood. I'll have you know that the Threepwood name has a long and noble history. So does mine. I'd like to hear about the long and noble history of the Cheese family. Aye, it'd be my pleasure. Naturally, no discussion of my family would be complete without mentioning my great-great-grandfather, who single-handedly revolutionized the art of roadside carriage wheel repair. Who is that? Are you daft? Have you never heard of Jack Cheese? I don't ride many carriages in my line of work. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Tell me again about this thing you call insult arm wrestling. I thought I'd made myself clear. It's just like insult sword fighting, but with arm wrestling. Ah. Hmm. It's been nice chatting, but I've got to see a man about a monkey. Wait, no. I, Hello again, I Mr. I think Cheese. that I know what... Yes. I think I know how to progress this. Are you sure there's nothing I can do to convince you to navigate my ship to Lucre Island? I'm open to persuasion. What do you have in mind? All right. If I beat you at insult arm wrestling, will you be my navigator? Hmm, that's an interesting proposition, Threepwood. It is? I mean, of course it is. How about this? If you beat me, I'll be your navigator. Great. But only if you teach me some new insults. Agreed. Well then, let's see what you've got. All right. I'm not sure I know any insults, though. Uh, today, by myself, 12 people I've beaten. From the size of your gut, I guess they were eaten. Ah, oh, damn, he knows that one. Do I see quivers of agony dance on your lip? Um, let's see. I see quivers of agony dance on your lip. See, every comeback is appropriate and rhymes. It's the exact same way insult sword fighting uh, has worked throughout the, the game. Or throughout the, the franchise history. Um, oh, shoot. I don't think I know this one. Yeah, you got some really bad ones down here too. Uh. Uh, and over That's the not the right one, but that problem. Hey, look over there. Uh, let's see. Hey, look over there. That's a really bad one. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. It's a three-headed monkey. Okay, so not all of them rhyme, but they are appropriate. Your arms are no bigger than fleas that I've met. Oh, so that's why you're scratching. I'll go see a vet. My 98-year-old grandmother has bigger arms than you. Okay, bigger arms than you. 98-year-old grandmother, bigger arms than you. Um... I'm surprised you can count that high. Nope, not right. My forearms have been mistaken for tree trunks. Okay, I know the, the response for this one. Uh, an over-the-counter defoliant could help with that problem. There we go. Uh, my 98-year-old grandmother has bigger arms than you. Yeah, but we both got better bladder control than you do. <laughs> Your arms are no bigger than fleas that I've met. Oh, come on. Uh, so I already used that one against you. I'd go see a vet. All right, uh, let's see. Uh, I'm going to put your arm in a sling. Oh, how appropriate. You fight like a cow. Oh, that's a... That wasn't the right response. Ah, my stupefying strength will shatter your own into a million pieces. Oh, I'm surprised you could count that high. Only Damn. once have I met such a coward. Only once have I met such a coward. Something that has to do with a coward. Um... I mean, this might work, but... Uh, I'm 
shocked that you've never gazed at your wife could work as well. But I think this one might be it. I'm sure that spineless creatures everywhere are humbled by your might. You're not very nice. Oh please, you call that an insult? Yeah, it's like seriously. I've got muscles in places you've never even heard of. I'm shaking. <laughs> I'm shaking. So you didn't know that one. Uh, give up now or I'll crush you like a grape. Oh, how appropriate. You fight like a You didn't know like that one either. I won. Yep. You did. Fair and square. Congratulations. You got yourself a navigator. Now I still need a ship and uh, more crew. But I think we're good in here for now. Let's take a look at our inventory real quick. Bowl of jerky pretzels. May as well. I wish I had some grog to wash that down with. Yeah. Well, we can't get any grog right now. So I think we're done with the scum bar. Can I pick up the bottle? I'm not picking that up. Oh. I'm not picking that up. Darn. All right. Uh, no, I didn't want to do that. Ah, oh, damn it. again, mateys. Wrong button. Excuse me. Hey. I accidentally hit enter. I meant to hit shift. Oh, don't tell me the game froze. No. So why am I not? Oh, shoot. No. No, 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 no. I mean, I can still pull this up. Shoot, I haven't saved at all either. Let's go ahead and save real quick just in case something happens. All right. But I think I may have uh, I may have fucked this up. All right. Uh, let's take a look here. Load. Shoot, the game glitched on me. Ah, damn it. I don't want to do this, but I'm going to I'm going to have to start a new game and get back to here. That's okay. It, it's it's not too much trouble. A lot of that I can skip, so here we go. All right, and we're caught up. It didn't take that long. I didn't have to go through like all the conversations that uh, I went through last time, so that certainly helps. And this time I don't talk to those guys and I just leave. There we go. All right, uh, can I go? Yes, walk to Melee Island. There we go. And now we can explore. So we've got two locations still we can go to. I mean, we've got Governor's Mansion up here, but let's let's go over here to Meat Hooks. Meat Hooks Wax House of Wax. Hey, look, a full moon. Can I pick, pick up, up the moon? The moon? Are you nuts? Why not? <laughs> All right. Wax show. So yeah, we actually have a bridge here this Lock. time. What? Knock knock. Who's there? Anybody home? No. Go away. But uh Then who are you? Yeah. Uh, no one. There's no one here. When do you expect someone to be home? Later. Much later. Finish running your wife's errands first. What? But there's supposed to be a wax <clears throat> show today. No, there isn't. Yes, there is. No, there isn't. The sign out here says there is. Uh, yeah, there. Well, it's cancelled. <laughs> it's okay. It's me. Me? Who? I'm the plumber. I've come to fix the sink. That ploy won't work. I know why you're here, and you can't have it. What are you have talking what? about? Stop pretending, you greedy old man. You think you can just buy up the old island just because you can insult people? Well, think again. You can't take my house away from me if you can't get in. I knew I shouldn't have fixed that bridge. There's <laughs> nobody home. Now go away. Okay, I'll come back later. Yeah. All right, so there's nothing we can do with Meat Hook right now, I don't think. We don't actually need them now either, now that we have uh, I Cheese as the, our navigator. But we still need a ship. And we've still got to get a contract for Carla and Otis. Alright. Let's see. Ooh, we've got a 
Well, let's go ahead and pick up that pop dinner tube first. Because we need that. Alright. It's empty. Aw. I sure could go for a nice refreshing grog right now. Yeah. I'm not picking that up. Oh, didn't mean to do that. I can't use this machine. <sighs> I don't have any money. Oh, that's a shame. Alright. Talk to Lady of Leisure. I'm Guybrush Malt. Reapwood. <laughs> How nice for you. And just what do you want me to do about it? Are you the harbor master? No, I am the harbor mistress. My full title is Chief Assistant Shipyard Regulator, Harbor Operations, Melee Island, a division of Inter Island Transportation Services. Which means? Which means I'm in charge of ship allocations on Melee Island. All right. Baby, you can be in charge of my ships any day of the week. What? Are you trying to seduce a government employee? Uh, no. So, uh, you're in charge of the ships? Yeah, she's very, very by the book. Kind of snooty for a glorified barnacle watcher, aren't you? You're just jealous of my cushy government job. It would be even better if I didn't have to put up with the likes of you. <laughs> I'm commandeering a vessel. Not so fast, mister. No boat leaves this harbor without my permission. And I see no reason to give you permission to take one of my boats. But Stan said I could. Name dropping won't get you a boat. Aww. I'm married to the governor. I heard she was dead. Well, she does have her quiet moments, but she's alive and back on melee and ready to govern. Oh, so she's just been on vacation all this time, huh? That's nice. She won't be governor for long. I'm voting for Mr. Charles. He promised me a promotion. What? Come on, just give me a boat. The rules prohibit the shipyard regulator, that would be me, from lending a boat to anyone who does not have proper authority. That would be you. But, but... What would it take to get you to look the other way? I really hope that you aren't trying to bribe an employee of the Melee Island government. Not no. that I care what happens to you, but I really don't want to fill out the paperwork. 